Jerome McCoy, he was a late night study to about pharmacology. Now, pharmacology is about drugs and how they interact with the body. When I talk about drugs, I mean drugs like a doctor will give you a prescribed and just like inject them pill, mostly pills, anything like that that's most convenient to use. Or drugs, like drugs, like coke, dope, crack, smack, weed, DVDs, CDs, all that. They all follow certain things and that's how they affect us in certain ways. But the, the quote of the day, I got a test tomorrow on pharmacology. So, you know, I'm studying, it's a little beast. Like, I'm prepared for it though, I'm going to tackle the beast. But I just want to share this one quote that really drives things home. It says, Drug action is limited to mimicking or blocking the body's own regulatory molecules. Drugs cannot give cells new functions. Rather, drugs can only alter the rate of pre-existing processes. In other words, drugs cannot make the body do anything that it's not already capable of doing. So any drug you're doing, and by drug, anything that alters the, the body, alters a living system. That's what a drug is. A pharmacological term of drug is anything that alters a living system. So that could be drinking, smoking, any prescribed pills, any anything. It's, it's not going to create something crazy in you. It's something new that never existed. It's all something in you. If you're putting something into your body, it's going to either stimulate or block uh, pre-existing something. So if you're taking a, a medication for one thing, it's, it's going to excite that is gonna whatever that is that specific receptor that it binds to is gonna enhance it. If you wanna, that's like uppers and downers. I guess the same way is like that. Uppers is gonna enhance certain things and the way certain things fire in your brain around your body. And like I know opioids like dope or like morphine, codeine, anything with the e in the end that that it's a it suppresses your 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 respiratory system. Like you, if you're OD on that, that's because your respiratory system fails. Like that's what it is mostly. Your respiratory system thing. It's, it lowers your your breathing. It's a it's a downer. It brings things down. So each drug is not it's not gonna do anything crazy to you. Like it will do things crazy to you, but the mechanism of the way it acts is on something that already exists in your body. Any drug, and by drug I mean anything that changes something. So anything that changes something in your body, no matter where you get it from, where on the earth you get it from, is already inside you. It's just triggering a certain something inside you to create that. So that's a pharmacological tip I wanted to add. So everybody enjoy your day and just know this. And this could be down to a, a, a cup of coffee or a cup of soda. Could be a cup of anything. A cup of alcohol. It, all these three things, juice. Can juice be considered a drug? I don't know. That's a whole other topic. So, so much vitamin C in a certain way. It, what does it activate certain things that it alters the living system? So it could be classified as a vitamin. Could it be a drug? I don't know. That could be a whole PhD paper. You could have a PhD on that. Are vitamins drugs? Water soluble, fast soluble, break down anything. It's crazy, but just know that. What you're doing is your body, you're affecting something. You're either slowing it down or you're speeding it up. That's it. These are my news.